What's up guys, this is Olimers, watch this video in 1080p, upload videos daily, so you should come subscribe to my channel. So today guys, I am still in the Prius from last episode, and I'm actually gonna go switch cars, and also, you know how I said I ain't change the clothes, well they took away the DLC items, so, I wonder if I still have, yeah I still have the proximity mines, I don't know if those are DLC, or if they're always gonna be in, but they, I just logged in today, and... I don't have any the winter clothes on, so dang it, Rockstar. I mean, I can't really complain. All the items were free, but it would be nice if like you could pay for them and then you can keep them forever. Look at me dodging and weaving through the traffic, you know, driving on the wrong side of the road. Cause oh, oh, look at this handling with front wheel drive. Look at this, guys. That was pretty epic. What a kind of car is that? Ah, oh, dang it! I just hit a pole. So today, if you do, or if you did or didn't watch my last video, you would know that today is my first day of school, back in 2015. And I got some homework, not too much, but tomorrow, it might be a snow day, but not because of snow, but because it's supposed to be like negative 15 degrees. So I know there's going to be one kid saying, negative 15, that's nothing. I walk to school, negative 15, at least two miles. And if you do, then you guys are more prepared. I'm not. Alright, which car should I choose? I'll choose the Dukes this time. I haven't chosen in a while, so. I think I only drove this once while I was recording, so. This will be great for you guys. And it had the same paint job, so. While this video is rendering out, I think I'm gonna either do my homework. Or I'm going to go, oh, that is not good, sir. Don't do that. But I'm going to either do my homework or go play Forza Horizon 2. And that guy just cut the corner terribly. Go play Forza Horizon 2 and download the DLC because it has a new Nissan car. I don't even know what it's called, but it's not a production car. And it looks amazing. Just listen to this engine. This thing sounds amazing. Wait, what is that going to do? Oh, I know, I know now. The clothes store. If there's one thing that I would want in this game, is JDM cars, like the S13, the S14, and the S15, or 240SX. It doesn't really matter either one. The only difference between 240SX and the S, the Sylvia's, is the Sylvia's have fixed headlights. The 240SX have pop-up headlights. Sylvia's are turbocharged, I'm pretty sure. And I think uh, there was something else. I can't remember what it was. I'll probably remember it later, though. Okay, time to take a drive. Guys, I might just cut out all the time I was talking in there because it's getting kind of boring for me. So I'm probably not going to put it in. So, guys, some breaking news. Or not really breaking, but some stuff has been going around recently. Um. The most recent thing that has to do with gaming, and actually I talked about it in my last video, Neil X Mods uh, doing these DNS lobbies. Okay, so he had a donation fund, and he had Twitter, obviously. He closed down his Twitter and closed his donation fund. We don't really know if he's scamming yet. I don't know of anyone that actually got the DNS from him. But if you did donate to him... You can always go on PayPal, charge back, or if you donated with something else, you can call the provider and say you were scammed, and they'll give you your money back, because it was a donation, so you can get your money back. Just like, if you donate on Minecraft, you can charge back. But, I really... Now no one's going to trust him forever. No, no one's going to make videos about the stuff he leaks out anymore. He just basically ruined his reputation as hacker. Or, not really hacker, but... Like, figuring stuff out for online. So, the other thing that has recently happened is... We don't know if this is 100% true, but we know it's basically 100% true. So, recently, like, the pranking community, the pranking scene... They've been faking a ton of stuff. Like, you don't know how insane it is. How much they're faking it, but insane, it's real. And this one dude, Josh Paler Lynn, he gave a hundred dollars to the homeless, a homeless person, and then he went inside a liquor store and then bought food for random people in the park. 
it was all just for publicity and money, obviously, because it has, like, I don't know how much millions of views it has, but the news networks are even putting it on, and the very moment I watch a video, I was like, has to be fake. Why would he do that when he could just be saving it for himself so he's not hungry in the future, you know? But that's just what I think. And there's various different videos that are proving it's fake. So if you want to go watch some, you can just type in fake Josh Paler Lynn homeless donation. And plus, another thing is Josh Paler said he was following the dude for 15 minutes, but the store the homeless man went into is right next to the park. So it's either a dude's really, really, really slow, a really slow walker. Or he's just lying, like everyone thinks he is. Oh, also, there's this prank video, or not prank, why do I keep saying prank? But, like, a quote-unquote social experiment where there's two homeless people arm wrestling for $100, and whoever loses doesn't get any money, but the winner gets $100. And in the end, he gave them both 100 I'm pretty sure. So, the dude that won the $100... He ended up giving it to the other guy that lost because he felt bad for him. Then the guy that won, he got another hundred, so they ended up both with a hundred. But when you see the first video of them picking up the first homeless guy, you can see the second homeless guy in the background just like sitting down with his tie-dye shirt. You can see, I'll link it in the description, and you can see him in the reflection of the glass. So that just proves there's way more stuff that's faked than you think out there, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe if you feel I enjoy or er, fail. Feel I deserved it. There you go. See you next time.